This is Lesson 25 in Module 3. In this lesson, we're going to be exploring the properties of prime and composite numbers up to 100 by using multiples. For this lesson, we're going to be starting right off with our problem set. So this says to follow the following directions. First, shade the number 1 red. Let's do that. Okay, then it says to cross off, to circle the first unmarked number. So the first unmarked number is 2. Then it says to cross off every multiple of that number except the one you circled. If it's already crossed out, skip it. So let's do this together. So the multiples of 2 are 2, are two times 2, 6, 8, 10 all the multiples of 2. Let's do that together. Actually, we could just go down the row because we know these are all multiples of 2. Let's fix that one. Okay. Then it says to repeat steps A and B until every number is either circled or crossed off. So we're going to do these two over and over again. So first we circle the unmarked number. So the next unmarked number is 3. And then we're going to cross off the multiples of 3. So 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, 36, 39, 42, 45, 48, 51, 54, 57, 60, 63, 66, 69, 72, 75, 78, 81, 84, 87, 89, uh, 90, 93, 96, 99. So you're going to continue doing that with the next unmarked number. So the next one would be 5. So you'd be doing multiples of 5. And continue till the entire chart is done. So stop the video and try that yourself. Okay, for 5, we did 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. The next unmarked number is 7. 7 plus 7 is 14, plus 7 more is 21 plus 7 more is 28, plus 7 more is 35, plus 7 more is 42, plus 7 more is 49, plus 7 more is 56, plus 7 more is 63, plus 7 more is 70, plus 7 more is 77, plus 7 more is 84, 7 more is 91, 7 more is 98. The next number we have is 11. 11 times 2 is 22, then 33, 
44, 55, 66, 77, 88, 99. Then we have 13. 13 times 2 is 26. 13 more is 39. 13 more is 52. 13 more is 65. 13 more is 78. 13 more is 91. And 13 more would be more than 100. Then we have 17. 17 times 2 is 34. 17 more would be 51. 17 more would be 68. 17 more would be 75. 17 more would be 82. And 17 more would be 99. Then we have 19. 19 plus 19 is 38. Plus 19 more. If we continue in this pattern, we'll see that we have 20, then we have 23, then we have 29, then we have 31, then we have 37, 41, 43, 47, 53, 59, 61, 67, 71, 73, 79, 83, 89, and 97. Those would be the ones that were not crossed out. Then looking at, for 2A, list all the circled numbers. So take a moment to list all the circled numbers. Okay, we got 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17, 19, 23, 29, 31, 37, 41, 43, 47, 53, 59, 61, 67, 71, 73, 79, 83, 89, and 97. And why were the circled numbers not crossed off along the way? Think about that. And the reason were, was they were not multiples. of any numbers except one and themselves. And except for the number one, what is similar about all the numbers that were crossed off? Take a moment, go back and look at those. What do you see? What's similar about them is they are all composite numbers. They all have factors other than just one in themselves. Pause the video and think for a minute about D. And what's similar about all the circled numbers is that they are prime. Because this is the definition of a prime number. No factors except one in themselves. They're not multiples of any numbers except one in themselves. Therefore, they're prime numbers. And that's the end of Lesson 25.